welcome to the show, everyone. Thank you for joining me today. Appreciate it. Soft Cell Memorabilia. Now, this is their first single. Soft Cell was pretty hard to find in the U.S. Early stuff. I think um, my girlfriend at the time had uh, a friend of hers bring back from the U.K. Soft Cell, the singles. And that was the first time I had heard any other music. So I think I borrowed it, dubbed it. Those of you who know, in the 80s, you'd borrow stuff from your friends and dub it onto a blank cassette. And that's what you had. The quality wasn't that great. But that was the first time I heard Soft Cell. Obviously, I know Tainted Love and some other stuff. But going back to 1981, memorabilia, their first single, thought that'd be a good place to start because I want to do more. It seems like a band that I like missed out on since I just had no way to have access to them in the early 80s. So I thought, why not do the very first single? 1981, that's pretty early. Synth is pretty young in 1981. I do know Mark Allman from like 87, 88, solo stuff, uh, Tears Run Rings, fabulous tune. But let's go back to 81, first single, let's go. Soft Cell. Love the drum beat. The electronic drum beat. Cause I'm the lady with the hot surprise If you don't believe me, I saw some 
on that song so much going on in that that was good huh I didn't expect that three things I guess my number one impression would be how good the mix is the distorted synth in the back was really 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 good the pace of it was fantastic I think it had a more modern sound than I expected for 1981 hmm yeah, that had that had elements in it that would totally translate today. Really, really would. All right. Second thing would be having Mark sing and then having the woman come in. And they both kind of did a a slow down monotone speaking type of element toward the end. That really worked. I really liked that a lot. Um seems kind of like a uh pretty modern way to do it for 1981 no wait that should th that's their first single that must have blown people away right if this unless this is a remix or something but the style what i just saw was i'd have freaked out if i heard that in 1981 i've been all over that yeah i would have been all over that man Third thing, I, I can see how this, I can see how the artist, the band, Soft Soft, I can see how this type of electronic dance music in the early 80s would definitely have pushed the genre forward. You know what I mean? If that is, if you're dealing with like an OMD and a New Order, stuff that was going to push the genre forward. I can see Soft Cell being uh, very important in that way. Just part of a UK scene that was just elevating the whole thing. It's funny, yeah. The, the, the center of what I liked as an American was totally in the UK. In the early 80s, pushing forward with uh, electronic music. This is totally in my wheelhouse. Yeah. That's got a vibe, even for today. This is the type of song I can see where it lends itself to doing like many different remixes, you know, so you could put a club version and kind of give more exposure to it. That, that's the great thing about memorabilia. When, I, when you hear a song like this, you can tell, you can break this apart and do so many different things. So I can see why I assume they were a big club artist based on the style of music they do. And with a unique voice like that, the, the sounds and the, uh, just the synth part, I can see where you can pull that apart and do all sorts of extended mixes and stuff with it. So, which is perfect for, you know, a synth pop genre, because you're gonna, even today, you're gonna make like 
sometimes five, ten different freaking mixes out of these, right? So that that works. All right, thank you for joining me today. Soft Cell, happy to have them on the show. I can't wait to do more. But why not start with memorabilia? I'm impressed. What can I say? I'm impressed. Dang, I missed out. I missed out on so many good artists uh, in the in the moment, you know, when they were doing their thing. Right, I appreciate you being here. I appreciate you watching. And I will see you next time on the show. Thank you so much.